Hello, Buzz and Girls. My name is Hotsty, and welcome back to another episode of Oxygen Not Included. Last time we started our first rocket, it returned, uh, and now we can continue with our research. Um, and we have to see that we get the second rocket ready and currently we are not pumping in any fuel here because the steam temperature that is in here is too low so one thing we can do is we add more regolith in here and that should heat up the sink. Right, that's the plan. Hopefully it works. And then down here, we're trying to expand our base. Um, we need to cool it down still a bit. At least the lower levels almost have reached uh, agreeable temperatures up here. We're still nearly 40 degrees. But yeah. Um, we will have... Five going there. So only when we are actually ready to move in, I will replace this door with a solid wall and then we can break open on this side. But I guess that will still be quite some time. How is our research doing? Yeah, it comes along. Solid fuel booster. That's actually not that that helpful. So I tend to skip that and then go directly to the to the next stage. Steam seems to heat up a bit, despite that we uh, constantly pull in uh, water that is around 85 degrees. So maybe we could turn off this pump. So that the steam that's in here is actually heated up by the regolith and not constantly uh, cooled down again by the water. 
and I think we have enough in here for a, a, a second load here unless we are losing much due to a broken pipe and and such storage is not full so actually they should be able to clean up this mess here temperatures uh, still not where I want to see them Once we have this sort of out, we can then accept more duplicates. Um, what I'm missing though is plastic for the beds. I think most of it currently goes to here. Yeah, so there's a bit of, of plastic lying there and a bed needs 200. That's just enough for one bed. One. We are going up. Uh, what happened here? Um, overheat, maybe. Perhaps we need a bit of uh, cooling magic here. always good all right then here a bit of crude oil and then of course this and let's make it out of uh, gold amalgam that should help with the temperatures a bit I don't intend to uh, have any uh, uh, active cooling here just the liquid on the floor should help and at 125 we will again start pumping 
and the temperatures are chosen to be above uh, 100 degrees so that while the steam is being pumped here in the pipes it will cool down but if it cools down too far it will condense and break the pipe and if the pipe is broken then the steam flow is interrupted and uh, all other steam packets in the pipe are also cooling down so I think we are good here. Have a bit of oil there on the floor. temperature doing here from this side we get cool temperatures because we have all this this cool setup here so but eventually we will close up this with uh, isolated tile so we will not have this this heat bridge or cool bridge as it is here on this side There was a time where we had more Recklets. Not sure what happened with them. Maybe um, could not feed them because um, we run out of, of dirt. Currently we have quite a bit. Not n quite a bit. Not much. But own at this point we only need dirt for the meal meal mold and for um, later on for a bit more research here in the research station I think um. yeah Okay, then here we are done. Is that and let's place the next few things that we need on here. Always a tile too much. Then can bring this down to here. Half 
the bridge there. Like this, like, like that. And have this go up to here. Nice! How is our steam doing? 123 degrees. How is the cooling doing here? At one point uh, there is too much heat, at another uh, it's too less. Research for booster is done. Um, how are we looking steel wise? Yeah, can add more. The booster that's this one, which can be added. Thing on certain modules, on top of certain modules. Okay. First bed there is done. But temperatures are probably still too high, and let's complete at least three rooms here before doing anything crazy. Oh, and it looks uh, our iron volcano is producing iron again. Which is nice. We have run a tiny bit low. Yep, there it is. All the good iron. And of course, for the for the next research, we also have to do uh, to do it with the uh, all the two uh, uh, stations. But this will give us the petroleum engine, the liquid fuel tank, and the solid oxidizer tank. And with that, we can make more progress. And then here we get a liquid oxygen tank and a hydrogen engine. Which will be a uh, top notch. But I think we're still a, a, a bit, bit away from that. Um, because producing liquid uh, oxygen and hydrogen that's quite a feat so we will probably do a few uh, petroleum rockets um, based on uh, on uh, oxalate uh, and then maybe at some point we manage to create uh, migrate over to uh, liquid oxygen which is not too hard to get um, 
at least not as hard as uh, liquid hydrogen but I have a setup in mind that basically uh, combines both both these both together so we will see where we get with that but that's all for now we managed to uh, uh, start up with uh, some research did not manage to uh, get the, the second rocket going but we are uh, on the way with the, the steam heating up so join me next time for more oxygen not included until then goodbye